This video went viral across the nation after these three agents were caught by Telangana police who tried poaching four MLAs from Telangana Rashtra Samiti on last 26 October. Simhayadri, Ranjandra Bharti and Nandu. These three agents clearly claim themselves as the agents of BJP top brass leaders in this video. Yet, Central Minister G. Kishan Reddy denies the role of BJP leaders in this case. And also, the very next day, the Telangana BJP chief Bandi Sanjay takes oath at Yadadri Sri Lakshmi Narasimha Swami temple, saying that BJP leaders have no role in this case. Telangana government appointed special investigation team to investigate and report what exactly happened in this case, while BJP state leaders are opposing it by appealing it to the court. Direct question from the people of Telangana is why is BJP opposing Sitch Pro if not linked to this case? During the Sitch investigation, evidence in multiple ways establishes the links between the three accused and BJP top brass leaders. Their evidence with BJP's top brass is established by evidence gleaned with over 5 terabyte of data with call records text messages and chat conversations between them right from 2015. The call and message data shows the pattern in which the operation is carried out before being busted. The accused Ramchandra Bharti who was in Hyderabad calls Jeku Swami who was in Kochi. Jeku Swami in turn uh, rings up to Tushar Velapalli who is in Ahmedabad. Tushar Velapalli again rings up to BL Santosh who is in Gujarat at the same time following up with calls and messages and then reports to Amit Shah's office. Now it is a point of no escape for BJP. The data is being stored in 40 to 50 servers spread across several states in the country. And deleting such large amount of data is not possible technically. BJP finds itself in a web from which there is no escape.